What's up, everybody? It's Free Chain with Sexy Back Boot Camps in Kansas City. Today is your off week, okay? Just off week training. Uh, we have 10 exercise circuit we're gonna do. Uh, we're gonna start off with legs. We're gonna do some goblet squats. So grab your weight. We got 10 pounds plus on there. I wrote on there. All right, I have 15 pounds right here. Feet wide, toes apart. Coming down, keeping the hands close, chest close to your body. Okay, we're gonna come down. We're gonna go low enough. Okay, just down. Don't come all the way up. Slightly from lock, come back down. Breathe in, exhale. All right, so the circuit is 60 seconds of work with 15 seconds of rest. So just come down nice and easy. Breathe in, exhale up. Don't have to go fast, you don't have to go slow. Do the best you can. The stronger you are, use more weight. But right now, I only got 10 pounds plus, so right now I got 15. So right there, you can use as much as you can. You can even double it up if you want to. And you have two dumbbells here in your goblet squats. All right, the next exercise is gonna be chest. We're gonna do negative push-ups. So we're gonna get down on the ground. And the negative, again, we're gonna work as a focus on how slow you go down. So four second drop, down four, 1,000, three, 1,000, two, 1,000, one. Just let it touch, down four, 1,000, three, 1,000, two, 1,000, one. Again, try to keep your hands wide, a little bit outside the shoulder width. Coming down nice and slow, keep your flat back, abs tight, butt squeezed. Coming down nice and slow. From front view, show you here, four, three, two, let the chest hit first, one. So you can do that for the 60 seconds, 15 seconds of rest. All right, and the third exercise in the circuit, the walking lunges, okay? Um, I don't have much room in the camera, but we're gonna go here. Walking lunges, come go front lunges, step down, up, come up, step again with the opposite leg. So you can alternate, just walking, okay? Just go right, and we come right at the camera. Watch out, baby, watch out. So right, left, right, left, again, just sideways. Down, right, come up, and left. Just continue on from there. Fourth exercise, we're gonna do bent over two arm, bent over two arm dumbbell row. Now we're gonna focus on your back. Okay, keep a flat back, dumbbells in your hand. Okay, we're gonna start off with uh, 10 pounds plus, uh, 15s again. Flat back, so come over, about 45 degree angle, hands straight down. You're just gonna pull and drive that elbow up to the ceiling. Pull to your chest. Not fast, not slow, just nice even tempo. On there, the side shot. Again, we're gonna do a front view real quick. So here. Nice and easy. Squeeze right with the lower shoulder blade. Squeeze that back. That was high. Pretend like you're elbowing somebody. Use the energy. Maybe you're pissed off at somebody. Just squeeze, squeeze, squeeze. Right there. Alright, the next exercise can be a stabilization move. It's called side hops to stabilization. So we're gonna hop, hands on your hips, knees slightly bent. You're just gonna hop and hold, stabilize. Hold for three seconds. Hop, one, two, three. Hop, one, two, three. The focus is on stabilization and core. See how well your balance is? Side hop, stabilization. Back and forth, back and forth. Knees slightly bent, land it. You can see my knees slightly bent here. Okay, let's go back and forth. This is test your core out, okay? The next exercise is gonna be single leg, front dumbbell raise. Again, you can use 10 pounds plus, it's gonna work your shoulders. Your anterior delts, your front of your shoulders. So I'm gonna show a side view. Single leg, shoulders back, hands straight, grab the dumbbell, straight up, right to face height, down slow. Shoulders back, exhale, up, down slow. Again, single leg. If you can't balance, if your balance needs some work, put that leg, stagger stance it. Just put that leg on the ground. It's here. Feel free to switch legs. Maybe at the halfway mark when it says 30 seconds or halfway. Switch legs. Abs tight, squeeze, shoulders back. Single leg, front dumbbell raise. Right there. All right, the next exercise is going to be jump squats. Okay, on this one, I don't really need you to jump really high, but I do want you to explode as fast as you can and come up. So watch what I do, feet straight, about hip width, shoulder width apart. You're gonna come down. You don't even need to come off the ground. Just come, explode up. Down slow, explode up. Butt down, explode up. Okay, we're gonna add a little hop in there, okay? For beginners, you might wanna stay on the ground. Don't come off the ground. Just focus on coming up like that. Coming up onto your toes. Bam, drive that arm up. Okay, you can come from the side. 
slow, explode. Slow, explode. Again, you can come off the ground too. Get some hops in there. Continuous hops right there. So squat jumps is that one. Next one is going to be staggered stance, two arm dumbbell shoulder press. All right, next exercise is going to be staggered stance, two arm dumbbell hammer curls. So we're going to work your biceps, the guns. All right, so staggered stance here, but one leg in front of the other, abs tight. Work on your balance a little bit, shoulders back. Okay, hammer curl. It's like hammering a nail. So how would you hold your hammer? So it's called a hammer curl, two arm dumbbell hammer curl. So same time, coming up, nice and slow down. Come up, give me maximum effort. Slow down again, feel free to switch your feet, halfway, 30 second mark, switch your feet. Stand nice and tall, breathe in, exhale, breathe in, exhale. Again, this is gonna work your outer bicep, your guns, your biceps, there's your arms, good arm workout there. All right, the next exercise can be your legs. You have two more exercises left, exercise number nine. We've got um, alternating dumbbell front step ups. Okay, so we're gonna have dumbbells here. So again, do it without weight if you're beginning. Okay, try it out. Uh, maybe do a lower step from there. If I step on my, my right to your left right here in the camera, I'm gonna step up, alternate legs. Right leg, up and down, nice and easy. Left leg, up and down. I know you can't see my hand up in there, but step up, down. Right leg and left leg, up, down. Again, if you cannot do with weight, you can start on a lighter weight. But go on from there and progress yourself as you get stronger and stronger every week. All right, and the next one is going to be standing two-arm dumbbell overhead tricep extension. Okay, now we're going to work the back of your arm, your tricep. Okay, and get those sexy back, get those sexy arms, all right? So right here, you're going to be standing two feet together. Bring that dumbbell up, one dumbbell. Bring it all the way down. Exhale up. Breathe in, breathe out. Again, this is a beginner level one, so we're just going to start with two feet together. Abs tight, extend, all the way down, and up. Again, bring it all the way down, up. A good rule of thumb that I use is come down until it gets close to your back, right behind your, below your neck, and up. Again, you want those nice, sexy arms for summertime? Right here, blast those guns out. Get those triceps. You already did your biceps earlier, now you got your triceps. So, right there, exercise number 10. Do that workout, do it a couple times, do it for four weeks straight. Um, beginner level right there, just take it easy and use the weights that work best for you. Increase weights as needed. And uh, again, just help to do that and bring Sexy back. Have fun with it. And if you have any questions, just go to my website, www.sexybackbootcamps.com. Name's Creechay, Kansas City. I'll check you later.